What's going on gamers? I was going through my bulk and I ended up running out of uh, storage. So today I'm opening up a Chilling Rain Elite Training Box because I want the Elite Trainer Box uh, storage box. So that's what we're doing today. Uh, have any of you guys ever just opened product or bought something because you need the, the dumbest thing for something else? Like... I could just go, I could even open the box. I could just go and purchase like, you know, a cheap, 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 cheap card storage box or like a 5,000 count box for bulk. But I like the way that elite trainer boxes look. It's like a personal collection without it being personal, if that makes sense. Hopefully in this uh, chilling rain box, we pull something nifty. Do do do. Elite trainer box. I haven't opened one of these yet. I haven't opened an ETB in a while. So we have our artwork box thing. I have a collection of those. Our ETB box has this nice insert in it. That keeps it nice and tall so things don't get smashed on the inside. We have our instruction booklet. We have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight chilling rain booster packs. Um, nice set of looks like tie dye dice. Uh, and the set logo. Sleeves. Always gotta have sleeves. Sleeves are a commodity. There is a code. Because I don't play this game. And yeah, crinkly plastic. Basically what it comes down to. And then our nice booklet for looking at the whole set. Oh, this is a divider. So basically, I opened this for literally this box right here. Great, I know. It's the little things in life that inspire us to make videos or film things or do do crazy things. So chilling rain. We are looking for literally just alternate art carts. Um, that and Snorlax are the only thing with value in the set. Um, the gold Snorlax used to be enough of a pull to actually warrant opening the set and you get all your money back but uh now it's like you get a white code card and if it's not an alt art game over useless garbage you know two white code cards back to back that is shocking it looks like there's a uh hidden here one two three and I think that's it. Nope, four. Four for that energy. Fire energy. This pack is about to be fire. There is a hit in it. Raboot. Snorunt. Benipede. Snover. Slowpoke. They just did a uh, promo of him. Kind of in the same pose where he's sleeping. Weedle. And Zera Aura. V. Which is not an alternate art, so uh, it's literally like 75 cents. Woo! Dun 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 dun! Super awesome! We got a lot of pack value. Anything that's a green code card, not even worth opening. Nope. Rare. Grookey Viper. Green code card. Whoop. Glade and Deli Bird. Nothing, yeah, there's nothing else of value in here. Okay. Eight packs so far. Two back to back white code cards with uh, no monetary value. There is something in this pack. It's a white code card. So, so one, two, three, four. Here we go. Water. So much for the last pack being fire. Now we gotta sprinkle it down with some water. 
Clara, Broly, Castform, Quillfish, Ralts, Heracross, Castform again. Justified Gloves, because we were about to have some Justified Alternate Arts. No? Okay. Bam! Sandaconda VMAX. Still, still a cool looking card. Just, uh, not worth anything. Three packs left. Bam, we have Volcarona and Survivor. It's really, really late at night when I'm filming this. I'm so tired. Another white code card. Some damaged white codes there. Oh, there's a hit in here too. Wow. Why don't I just put the code in there? That was dumb. Four. Grass. The main three types. Fire, water, grass. Flaffy. Path to the Peak. Ladian. Snover. Slowpoke. The Crab. Snowrunt. Weedle. Laron. And Metagross V. Blech. And a final white code card. Is there a hit in here? There is not. It's a hollow rare. So we're just gonna boop. Greedunt. So, um. Yeah. Uh, it was a $40 product. And that is your $40 worth of cards right there. Woo! Super good value, right? Gotta love Pokemon sets where you literally bust on like everything. Um, that's it. Anyways, I opened this for this, so I'm not upset about card values at all. Catch you guys in the next one, and uh, maybe someday I'll show you my big bulk ETB collection with all my bulk in it. Haha. <laughs> all right, take it easy.